Okay, I'll get this. Let's go too low. How about now? Let's go too low. How about now? Let's go too low. What the fuck is the point of those? They don't help. Whatever. Just break open. I don't have a grenade and some credits. I don't understand the whole, like, security tunnels and all that. Like, they, they don't help. They straight up don't help. I don't, I have never had a chance where, that where they actually helped. You guys are the last, last OBs in this place. As I make you feel. Never mind, JJ. Okay, put your lightsabers away. Please put your lightsabers away. Thank you. Hey, credits. Deathel Mimicker. And, oh, that's it. Oh, no, this place is fully explored. get out of here before Visquis executes me. Okay, where is she? Wait, what? He needs to choose one party member to accompany Aten and Beador. Um, hmm. Let's give HK-47. Party selection complete. Let's give HK-47 some, some, you know, some hints of time. Let's upgrade. Let's level him up too. I don't care what, what, um, skills you get, because I don't even use you for your skills. Honestly, I'll just use you to shoot things, if I ever use you. Proof power blast. Can I give you fighting upgrade? Da, da, da. Okay, yeah, I really can't give you anything. Proof power blast. Proof snapshot. Let's just get Time to power even the odds. <laughs> And we got Mr. Beador with his lightsaber. He has a short blade again. And he's still down pretty fast. Well. So wait a minute. HK is like leveling up on par with me, I'm pretty sure. I'd say he is. HK is pretty strong. I'll be honest. I would like the remains, thank you. Scott Afton, you are the supposed leader. Okay. Let me handle right. this. Let's go, yes, Master. I want, I want you to stay here, and I want you to shoot. You need a power blast on everybody. Just power blast everybody. It does a lot of damage. Just up. Oh, okay. I don't know. Does a lot of damage when he hits. So does Beidor. Beidor is doing quite a bit of damage. Thank you. Um. Where are we going exactly? Anybody know? I don't know. Oh. Okay, doors don't open. I'll just keep walking around. That door's not gonna open. We're going this way. To the where's the stocks? Okay, never mind, we are not going that way. I don't even know which way that is. Oh hey, there's some people over there I have to, I have to shoot. I didn't even notice that. It's so weird how HK walks. HK's an awkward awkward droid. Should have probably used sniper shot. This is pretty far. Oh. Beidor's gonna die. Beidor is so gonna die. What is up with his health? Yeah, Beidor is like getting killed easy. He's easy for everybody to kill. Oh, okay, there goes Atom. That was fast. Switching to combat mode. Switching to combat mode. At least this gives me a reason to, you know. Oh, no. To use your uh, repair guns. I got um, two million of them. Oh, hey, Atten, you're back. I forgot you have the fighting spear so that you don't die. Ow, that actually... Wow. 
HK. Has a lot of health. Just, just literally never dies. Hey, Baydor. I see that you hurt. How about some free health? I don't know. Dual strike. What does dual strike do? Your has advanced training using teamwork to fight. Yeah, no. You don't need to dual strike. Oh, uh, here. I'll give you that. Up and focus lightsaber. Powers. I was hoping it wouldn't be for scream. Because you are not getting force scream. I'm going to give you stun, though. Except. Acknowledgement. At in one of these days, you'll, you'll be able to level up again. One of these days. Can't go that way. Hey, more zugs. Zugs. Can't go that way. Okay. Um. It's a lot of people. A lot of them. Fire grenade, concussion grenade, thermo detonator. Sure, let's use a thermo. Whoa, hey, baby door. Uh, yeah. Wow. Wow, that thermo detonator. How much damage does the thermo detonator do you do? Uh, hello. Uh, 60 points. Man, that did just so much damage. That literally killed everybody. Wow, and only one person had remains. Oh, no, two people. But they did not have anything I wanted, so, you know, that's that's cool, too. Alright. Oh, that's nothing. I'll be honest, not exactly 100% sure what I should be doing right now. I have an idea of what I should be doing, but I'm not sure if that's actually what I'm supposed to be doing. Because that door doesn't open, so let's go try to see if that other door opens on the other side. Hopefully. Hopefully my game didn't glitch, because you know, that would be absolutely horrible. Hey, door- oh, door does open, okay. Oh, hey, back to happen. We made it all the way here, Adam. Glad somebody arrived. Saves me the trouble of having to break out of here. And you are? Mira. I've been watching you all stumble around this moon for a while, causing trouble. Now you've got Visquiz's attention, and he's the last person you want to have watching you. And how did he get he capture you? I was taken down like an amateur. I've never been inside the Jek Jek Tar, but they won't catch me the same way twice. You may have defeated Visquiz, but you won't take down Goto so easily. And now he's the one who has your friend. We need to find Kelsast and rescue well, him. We can deal with that once we're out of here and someplace safe. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, I finally arrived. Both, mu both much sooner yet much later than I hope. Add hope. That doesn't make sense. You're the one who wanted to see me, so what did you want? Very well. Let us dispense with the ple pleasantries. You are, after all, human. Based on your actions alone, it's a, I take it you are not familiar with the organization I serve or my responsibilities. I don't really care your responsibilities. I run the refugee sector. I decided that what happens here. I control the flow and currents of this sector. You have caused a great deal of trouble for the exchange here on Ashida, and I wish to know why. Okay, uh, to get your uh, I'm looking for so Why don't you tell me why you squeeze the life out of the refugee sector? I'd put any of the price on my head prior to doing. Um, why don't you tell me why you're squeezing life out of the refugee sector? We decided to put pressure on the refugee sector for some reason. Whenever seeming innocence or place in danger, especially human fodder, they're the Jedi are. Last it was blazing. It is curious though, we have been applying pressure on the humans in this sector for some time, and yet only now you do do you show yourself. I just arrived on our shot, gonna have helped people any faster. Ah, the Jedi have always been slow to act when danger threatens, more so when then the more so now than in the past, and you are no different. Still, if you're only a recent arrival, that, that would lead some validity to the rumors of another Jedi being here on Arshadah. 
Fortunately for me, I require just the one. And F, why did you put a bounty on my head? On me. So, no, wait. So you hired bounty hunters to track me down? Why? Oh, you mistake me. I was not the one who put the original bounty on you. We all serve our masters, you know. Uh, my soon-to-be-deceased boss, Goto, is the one who placed the mon monumental sum of credits upon you. The price is so high that any bounty hunter who captures you would be able to buy their own planet. You must have angered Goto greatly for him to hunt, hunt you so. And that is why you are at the perfect bait, and why I will bring you to Goto and then kill him. The gas. It isn't you, uh? Sounds like he was struggling on open source. Order y'all, attack the Jedi. Alright. You all, attack the Jedi. You all, you never truly worked for me. While the Jedi remains on Nar Shaddaa, my eyes shall watch him. Goda, I didn't. I wasn't. Please take the Jedi. I offer the human as a gift, freely, as I would my own life. There's been enough killing. Stop! Okay, that's cool. Don't listen. What an amusing Jedi specimen you are. What's up with all the electricity? Come on. Is that necessary? Seriously. So much electricity. Why do you do this? Why? Did you not let me die? Because I need you to hunt, beast. This prey is something you have chased all your life. You are born and bred to it like no predator before you. You want to hunt the human Jedi? The Dixo? The kill her? No, that you shall not do. You will not bring harm to the exile, and if you do, beast, I shall break you. The screams of your tribe of primitives, the scene of lying blinded with the huntress's blaster at your skull, I shall make it so that is all you hear and see for the rest of your days. Even your madness will not save you if you bring harm to the exile. Know this. Kill me. I cannot bear the weight of another life dead. Kill me, I, or I swear, I shall kill you. Oh, the life debts of your people, the life debt you have twisted with your hate, I felt it within you. I shall promise you this, beast. Unlike the red-maned Huntress, as long as you are loyal, I shall never show you mercy, no pity. But most of all, I promise you an end to your debt. Hunt her, pursue her, kill her, and ending her life will end your debt to me. The pain will pass. I was able to heal some of the wounds, but the rest must remain. You will need that pain when you travel, and it will give you strength for the hunt to come. Where? Where can I find Mira? I will tell you where you must go. If you survive that place, then she will come to you. But first, I must prepare you for what is to come. I hate Korea so much. I didn't have my player monitor for a second. It's kind of weird. We took out Viscous, but Goto has him, and that means no bounty for me. 
Then how do we get him back? There's no way to get him back. No one knows how to reach Goto except Visquis. And that squid head died in the Jack Jack Tar. The only way to reach Goto is if we had a Jedi. But now, he's got your friend. He doesn't have anybody else he wants captured. How does Goto hide his ship? He's got a cloaking device. He's the one that arranges the meetings on his ship, and until then, he can't be found. Trust me, if anyone knew how to track his ship, he'd have every bounty hunter and criminal on Nar Shaddaa gunning for it. There must be a way. I say we hit orbit, uh, hunt, ask him to start You were hunting for Goto's yacht. Your freighter would be flying blind. Well... Unless it was one of Voga the Hutt's cargo ships. Then it would be snapped up by Godo pretty quick. Voga the Hutt? Godo's been preying on Vaga's freighters for a while now. It's the reason Vaga's had to haul his bulk up here to Nar Shaddaa from Nel Hutta. Even with all the traffic around Nar Shaddaa, Godo seems to always know which ones are Voga's, and his ship just snaps them up. How would he know that? He does it by tracking their transponder codes, but no one knows how he's getting them. So if we get one of Voga's transponder codes, then Godo's ship might come to us? Yes. You'd need to get the codes first, then retrofit your ship so it had the right transponder signal. Problem is, Vogus shut down the droid warehouse until he can find out who's been leaking the codes. You'd have to be a droid to get in there. I already have two. I have a new droid for Volga. 2,000 credits. Before I accept this, I must ask you how you acquired this particular droid. I am champ. I went in and Pazak match. See? There should be no problems then. Credits will be transferred to your account as usual. Good. How I do. You're welcome. Good luck with your plan, little droid. T3 is like so not a droid anymore. Like he That's does whatever he wants. Report to C7 E3 for assignment. Alright, I can do that. 